bacon bracelet, vegetable earrings, a popcorn pin, and a taco-shaped hat? This DIY jewelry looks so tasty. Too bad it's not edible. Watch the battle of accessories in our new video. Fast food versus healthy food inspired jewelry. Christy enjoys eating healthy since she's a fitness blogger. But for some reason, her vegetable assortments don't get a lot of likes on social media. What's wrong? Blondie, the queen of burgers, knows the answer. Nowadays, regular photos of food aren't impressive at all. You need to shoot something striking. For example, earrings that look like juicy burgers. Make four parts of burger buns from air dry clay. Shape white clay into sesame seeds and attach them to the tops of the buns. Shape green clay into lettuce. Cover the bottom halves with them. Put earring studs into the top parts and place pieces of red clay to be tomato. Put a yellow square on top. This is a slice of cheese. Prick the other half of the burger. Let the clay harden. Assemble the burger. These awesome earrings have ears instead of patties. It's not surprising that they get a lot of likes from fast food lovers. Christy decides to outdo her friend's success. Now that she knows the new trend, she can turn her veggies into earrings. Roll light clay into a ball. Stick in an eye pin. Shape clay into thin leaves and attach them to the ball, shaping a head of a cabbage. Add veins on the leaves with acrylic paint. Attach an earring piece. Roll four pieces of clay. Slightly press every piece with your finger. Join them together making a base for broccoli. Make clay balls of different sizes and attach them to the base. Create a broccoli texture with a needle. Put in an eye pin. Paint branches and veins on the base. Attach earring pieces. Christy created two healthy and green earrings that look like cabbage and broccoli. Now let's see how many likes this healthy collection of accessories can get. Cabbage is way better than burgers, but Blondie is ready to accept this challenge. It's a battle of food jewelry. Christy is looking for inspiration from nature. A hat made out of branches? A ring from a flower? That's not what I need. And Blondie is eating fast food again. Her friend's sandwich inspires Christy to make an arugula pin. Print out a picture of an arugula leaf. Cover it with parchment paper. Squeeze out green hot glue following the template. Take off the piece when the glue hardens. Press in a vein in the center with a heated awl. Color it with white acrylic paint. Coat the leaf with glittering green nail polish. Hot glue a brooch pin to the back. One minute and Christy turns arugula into an elegant pin. How beautiful! Even Blondie starts thinking about a healthy diet when she sees this pin. Christy posts a picture of it on her Instagram. Likes start flooding in like health nuts running to yoga. Blondie is catching up. While Christy is having a live stream with her fashion arugula, Blondie breaks into the shop with her popcorn. Cut a piece out of a plastic food container. Print out a picture of a popcorn cup. Place the plastic on top and trace the picture using colored permanent markers.
cut it out. Also define separate popcorn kernels and the round label on the cup. Place all the plastic pieces onto parchment paper. Put the extra popcorn and label on top as in the picture. Bake it for two to three minutes at 300 degrees Fahrenheit. The pieces melt together and shrink. Color the back side of the ready batch with white and yellow acrylic paint. Attach a badge pin. Now that's a twist! Christy's followers can't digest this cheesy, carb-loaded pin. Christy has to stop the stream. So it means that Blondie is the winner. Blondie wants to film a culinary masterclass because she's the best when it comes to cooking. She can cook with one hand tied behind her back. And as a result, she gets the most awesome bracelet in the entire history of high cuisine. Mix polymer clay of different colors. Roll it out and place thin strips of white clay on top. Make a roll. Grate white clay using a fine grater and cover the roll with it. Cut the roll into salami pieces. Place brown, white, and pink clay on top of each other, making layers. Press it and cut it into slices to make bacon. Shape it with your fingers. Make round holes in a round piece of yellow clay using a straw. Cut it into triangles. Stick rings into all the pieces to attach a chain. Bake them following the package instructions. Let the clay cool down and put the pieces onto a chain. Now that's a picnic set! Blondie's bracelet is obviously not for vegetarians. She's got bacon and salami, and even some tasty cheese! Blondie invites her friend to take part in this cooking adventure. Come on, put your hand in and take out your healthy diet bracelet. Roll air-dry clay into a ball. Press in a hollow in the middle. Define a walnut pattern with a modeling tool. Stick in a jewelry piece to attach the bracelet. Shape another ball into a crescent with a pressed-in arch in the center. Make a cashew. Make an almond from another ball. Slightly dampen the clay and make a pattern with a needle. Shape one more ball into a hazelnut. Make a pistachio from the last ball. Stick eye pins into each nut. Let the clay dry for a day. Color the hardened nuts with acrylic paint. And cover them with clear nail polish. Put all the pieces onto a chain. Assemble the bracelet. Christy gets a set of nuts. What a healthy bracelet. Too bad it's not edible. The girls adore their new accessories. Blondie can't miss an opportunity to tease her friend. She knows that there is absolutely no way Christy would ever drink soda. But Christy's patience is on edge. She takes her friend's can away and turns it into a crumpled necklace pendant. Attach a printed Coca-Cola label to a rectangular piece of foam paper. Roll a tube. Hot glue to fasten. Fill the tube with light clay. Press it to shape it like a crumpled soda can. Put in an eye pin. Color the lid with silver acrylic paint. 
attach a chain. But Blondie isn't sad. She likes the Coca-Cola necklace even more than her soda. She can always wear it on her neck. Thanks, girl! And Christy created a cute avocado pendant for herself. Shape dark and light green polymer clay into a circle. Wrap it around a yellow clay cylinder and shape it like a pear. Make the avocado peel pattern using a modeling tool. Freeze it for 10 minutes. Make a ball from brown clay. Cut the frozen avocado in half. Press in a hollow for the seed and put in the brown ball. Stick in an eye pin on top. Bake it in an oven following the instructions. Put it onto a chain. The girls take a selfie with their new necklaces. Their followers will decide which one is better, soda or avocado. Blondie is busy counting her likes, and Christy decided to make a surprise for her friend. She puts a crown on her head that'll prove she's the world's best fast food blogger. You deserve this taco! Cut a circle out of yellow foam paper. Cut a slightly smaller circle out of foam rubber. Hot glue it to the center of the foam paper and attach the foam paper shaping a taco. Stretch out the edges with your fingers. Apply acrylic paint to make it look like fried dough and traces of flour. Cut square paper pieces and round lettuce leaves out of red and green foam paper. Shape the light clay into corn, lettuce leaves, and pieces of ground meat. Attach the ingredients inside the taco. Hot glue it to a headband. Decorate it with a light clay chili pepper. This taco accessory is so creative! Blondie looks fantastic right away! But Christy is also a food fashion blogger. She deserves a crown too. But this time it's a green smoothie. Put gift filling of two green shades into a plastic cup in layers. Compact it. Cut black gift filling into little squares. Put them into the cup. Cover it with a cap. Put in a straw. Correct the shape of an old headband and hot glue the cup. This smoothie crown looks great on Christy. She's a healthy lifestyle icon. The whole world deserves to see our accessories. Let's start a food fashion week. Did you like our accessories that look like food? Then write in the comments which fashionable collection you support, organic or fast food. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so that you don't miss any new challenges on Troom Troom.